What is going on everyone? Joshua with Fish in the Mitten. I got Miss Mitten here with me and we are at the Ultimate Fishing Show Detroit here in Novi. I uh, am uh, exclusive. So we are gonna dip through the back door here. Um, I'm not gonna go through the front. I'm gonna try to go around to the front so I can show you guys like the walkthrough completely. But I figured going through the back would be a fun little look for everyone. So stick with me, let's get in there. here it opens at 11 so we're here a little bit early Taylor's repping her lakes area bait shop hoodie there right so as you guys can see this is like the boating side a lot of boating stuff over here what do you think? <laughs> yeah look at all these In a nice boat like this. You can fish off of that and you can party <laughs> off of that. What is up? Oh, ho, 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 ho. daddy likey. Look at the deck on that thing. Man, you guys, I wasn't able to get to this side yesterday because I was strictly at the booth. Uh, helping out. We did awesome there yesterday. It was amazing. We're gonna hop over there soon, but I just wanted to give you guys a look at the boat side here. So. It's like John boat style, but it's really upgraded. Wow, it's like yeah, it's fancy. like a V bottom, big V bottom. These are nice, all Lumacraft. Let's walk up on the deck here. Let's... Wow, look at all these boats, you guys. I mean, this place is. Giant. Yo, is that the 10,000 lakes over there? Is that where that's at? I don't even know. We got seminars over here. We got more boats and stuff over here. Wow. You've, you got, you know, con your concessions and stuff through here. All right, let's go see what's up. Wow, look at that. That's an awesome mount. How you doing? I'm doing well, how are you? All fishing, love it. Stickers coming off of him. Couple cool shots, fat boy jigs there. Um, I actually just linked up with a guy yesterday with these boxes. These are local Michigan boxes. Um, it's pretty much, you guys know I've been doing like MTB for a long time. I just bought one of these yesterday. I hooked up, bought one. I'm gonna get an ice box on the way and I'm gonna do an MTB box and one of these box comparisons for you guys. And we'll see uh, see how that works out. You guys know I like all local companies and buy in Michigan. So if that compares to MTB, we'll be switching over. Alrighty guys, so this is Patty. She's one of the owners of Lakes area. How are you doing? Getting ready for the show. Gonna be a big one today. Yeah. This is Kevin, this is her son. How's it going? So here we got our groove fishing boxes. Uh, brand new out. These things are rugged. So these are one ounce jigs, half ounce jigs. Look at those things aren't even falling out. All magnetic here. Pops open. Pull right out. It push back in. You don't have to stick them in or anything like that. 
really nice boxes. Um, next here we got like Fat Boy Jigs. He just started doing ice jigs, so these are kind of a few of his ice jigs he came out with. Um, he's really a walleye guy, so he does a lot of walleye jigs, big one ounce jigs. These are two new ones out to us. You got the purple nurple, the Pikachu on this, two new awesome colors. Um, Wind Out Worms, another local guy here, does awesome stuff, kind of cool trick worms, um, things you can use, um, like drop shotting, things like that. Um, more fat boy chicks as you go down here. Lady Hot Sellers. Over here we got roadside minnows. Um, as you guys know, these are my new plastics. These are the new go-tos. You got our perch eyes. These were hot sellers all day yesterday. Any of you guys that like to jig for walleye and stuff like that, there you go. One package left. These were selling hot yesterday. As you can see, we already sold out of two of them. Um, also, sticking on the jigging aspect. Any of you guys that are into jigging walleye, this is the new Denali Myriad. It's a five foot six jigging rod. So if you're right over the boat, small, doesn't wear your arm out. Um, you guys know I'm into the bass stuff. We're the only ones uh, at this show carrying the Denali bass rod series. Uh, looks like we moved it around a little bit. These are the new M3s. These things are like feathers. They are so light. They are so, it's a dream rod right there. Um, I'm going to be picking one of these up today. These are the uh, TAC series. Really, really nice rod. Um, really, really good price point. I mean, right now I think we're getting rid of them at, yeah, 109. Um, another rod just a, a little bit under that price point is the Fusion series. Also a really, really great series. Um, these are coming in right now at $89 show price. So make sure you guys stop by the booth if you're here today. It's gonna be a blast. We're gonna uh, kind of walk around a little more and see what's up. And then uh, I gotta get to work, so let's go. Two pounds, 12 ounce bluegill. Seventeen pounds, three ounces. Look at all the stuff. We got like knives and stuff here. Yeah, look at. This is obviously where they do some of their seminars and stuff like that. They get a guy going up on top of the boat there. All kinds of bass, bluegill, big perch in there. Yeah, look at that catfish chilling at the top. Yep, so they come up there, they do seminars, flip into the pond. What do you think so far, babe? It's awesome here. All right, everyone, we're at the Sasquatch Jigs booth now. Uh, this is a new company that I met yesterday. We're here with Dan, and uh, he's going to give us a run through of what their jigs are about and what makes them so unique. So here's the big difference. Sasquatch jigs, we have hair in the jig. So this is what we call authentic synthetic Sasquatch hair. <laughs> so what that does, if you look at these tanks right here, what that does is it opens up that skirt, gives that a really, really, really good secondary action with very little motion. Right. So a little twitch of the rod tip, any kind of motion makes that whole jig jump, that skirt move. The other thing about these is all have Gamagatsu hooks on them. They're really sharp, really sticky, really strong. But that hook, that curve shank hook, in our stand-up, we have a football, which is a true stand-up, and we also have a structure jig, which is also a true stand-up. Both of those are a true stand-up jig. 
that hook design, we spent over a year and a half putting that hook and that head together so that when you pin a fish, he does not come loose. You don't lose. That's why we have what we call the 100% hookup ratio. We're all pro fishermen, we all fish. We have a lot of guys on the pro tour that, that we work with with these jigs to put these together. These are legit, they're the real deal. You gotta awesome. check them out, sasquatchjigs.com. Awesome, thank you, Dan. You're welcome. This mitten's getting excited seeing all the food here. <laughs> What's up, guys? Who do we got here? Awesome. Ooh. Gills here. This is our signature dill pickle. Where are you guys based out of? Awesome. Oh yeah, Miss Mitten and her pickles. Here you are, man. Would you like to try one, sir? No, I'm not a pickle guy. I know, it's weird. Everyone tells me I'm weird, I know. <laughs> We're all weird. Oh what do you God. think? Awesome. Can I try a flaming dill? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Oh, here she goes. Here she goes. Do you? All right, thank you so much, brother. Thank you, guys. Yeah. Thank you. Cool stuff they got. Little tank that shows off what it is. Give us a little show, huh? World's small crankbait. Wow, look at that. That's right up your alley, huh? I love that stuff. That's amazing. All right, who do we, who do we got here? Created this. That easy. You take a simple buddy heater and turn it into a cooker. Stainless steel, heat resistant handle up to 425 degrees. You can fry an egg in there. That'll get so hot. You put butter in there. That easy. You were showing me yesterday. They're pretty strong, huh? Yep. You can put whatever you want on there. It'll hold whatever kind of weight you want to. Look at that. I mean, you can set whatever you want on there. It'll hold it. That's stainless steel, food grade. Yep. So, like I told you guys, I will be back by later to pick a couple of these up because that's such an awesome idea, incredible idea. Thank you so much for giving us a rundown. We appreciate it. Like we like said, three patterns and brothers and dinner. Awesome. We like Michigan products. You all know that. All Michigan made, they're stamped in the standish, and the handles come from California. Awesome. Thank you guys. Vexlar's here, freaking lit up like a Christmas tree. Nice catch. <laughs> Who do we got here? I'm a John McCann, from Jamming Sun Honey Fire. We have all our honeys raw on presses for all the honeys right here in Michigan. And we got a horse radish, hot blue mustard. Ooh, that's up my alley. Wow, that's huge. Right here, look. That's awesome. Thank you so much. Yeah. Oh, look at all these extreme baits. Those are cool. Tubes, those are awesome looking tubes. I'm doing well, how are you? We charge for That's fine. What do you charge? <laughs> I'm not making, trust me. Lunker City stuff here. Thing is sick. Just all kinds of fishing tackle to go through. Let's see 
Yeah, just buckets and buckets of bait. The trout pond, they got a rock wall here. Yeah, there we go. Trout pond, everyone can fish. And then it's cool, so they do a, uh, you can catch the fish and then you can go to the booth right over there and uh, they'll fillet it up for you and everything and you get to go home with fresh fish. Oh look, someone's got one. everyone we're probably gonna end it here hopefully you enjoyed the video i know it's gonna probably be a pretty quick walkthrough but there's a lot going on and we like to see stuff ourselves so if you did like it make sure you give it a thumbs up if you haven't already make sure you hit that subscribe button hit the bell for notifications and as always we'll catch y'all next time peace